your county's been fucking well, mine too. It's I been guess. very Our wild. Our county has it's been, been lit. Very wild. This lately. is just a couple days ago. This is also. This is a white male between five eight and five ten. He's got brown fuzzy hair. Sam Roberts. A convenience store surveillance camera caught him on video buying a drink around one in the morning on May second. Minutes later, deputies say he left Dixie Boy Travel Center just off. Dixie Boy oh, Travel Center. I know that one. I know where he is. I know that one. That's the one that there's a Loves across the street from that. And a taco bus. Well, no, what I'm saying is across the street. He's Bro, where Loves is. The ta- I know that taco bus. I know bus. exactly where it is. It's the Auburndale Water the Towers, Auburndale. right? There. I know mm-hmm. exactly where this is. Oh, ah. my God. I wasn't even looking Look at, at the, the water, water tower. tower. Yeah. It's right by the Auburndale Water Tower. Yeah, that's right off I-4. It's like literally right off I-4. Just off I four and Poke City. That's one of those exits. For those of you that are, we're going to go a little local here. Mm. Royce will agree with me. That's one of those exits where you're re- when you're really low on gas, you'll like very often you'll go. Let me see if I can make it past can this exit. It. Like I, I don't have to stop it. here. Yeah. Like you just because the roads suck on this exit. Yeah, they're very inconvenient. But then also, you know, there's just like taco bus and it's dudes jerking the off Dixie in the parking. It's called the Dixie Boy Fuel Center. <laughs> I mean, that enough should let you know. Travel Center just off I-4 in Polk City and approached a woman who was pumping gas. He walked up to her and exposed himself. Look, to be fair, and I'm not blaming the woman here. However, you did go to a Dixie Boy Fuel Center in Auburndale. That's all I'm saying, okay? She jumped in the car, locked the car, and then he walked up and rubbed himself on her rearview mirror. Well, why is there a mushroom? Why is there a mushroom imprint on your rear view? <laughs> it's very weird. It appears that this isn't the only place that he struck. Hey, it's Wacky Tie Guy, Ken Suarez. Ken Suarez loves his wacky ties. Yeah. There's a similar incident over in Tampa. The next day, more trouble. Uh-oh. I am almost 100% sure it's the same person. We need to know who this person is. They're a deviant. <laughs> And they're dangerous. Are they mech dangerous? Investigators say a man, presumably the same one, which exposed Chuck Slater Royce. Okay. Himself to a sunbather on Ben T. Davis Beach, right off the Courtney Campbell Causeway, and groped her. You're such a weirdo. Get the away from me. She was quick witted enough to record this video of him as he picked up his belongings and walked away. So this guy's a problem. Investigators in two counties, Polk and Hillsborough. How horny are you, bud? are now trying to find him. If there's two victims, there's three victims. If there's three victims, there's more victims. Well, I'm sure there's a, at one point it's going to stop. He yeah, I mean, you can't just amount keep... Of victims. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. If there's 99 victims, it's 450,000 okay, victims. Okay, let's relax, man. Which detectives are now determined to find as well. In Poe County, Ken Suarez, Fox 13 News. Now, if you think you know who that man is, Heartland Crime Stoppers is offering a $3,000 reward for information that leads to... This guy looks like if, uh, to... Jimmy Fallon and Beto O'Rourke had a yes, trans- Beto, transporter Be- accident. Yes, Beto O'Fallon. Yes. 